This is Take Two Movie Review. I'm Clinton Johnston. This week, Just Step. Ruth Bader Ginsburg now occupies a place in popular culture that is unprecedented for a Supreme Court justice. Just last year, she was the subject of the popular Magnolia Pictures documentary, RBG. Now, played by Rogue One's Felicity Jones, Ginsburg's back on the big screen in her own biopic, On the Basis of Sex. Producer-slash-director Mimi Letter and screenwriter-slash-Ginsburg nephew Daniel Stiepelman have made a film that starts with Bader Ginsburg entering Harvard Law School in 1956, only six years into Harvard letting women in at all. Bader Ginsburg enters one year behind her husband, Martin Ginsburg, played by Armie Hammer, who against all expectation is developing a really cool filmography. And all of this is an appetizer for the main dish, 1972's Charles E. Morris vs. the Commissioner of the Internal Revenue, i.e. the IRS, which both Ginsburgs argued before the Tenth Circuit Court of Appeals, and in which Bader Ginsburg first develops her strategy for future gender discrimination cases, where the film shows her legal secretary inventing the term gender discrimination. That's how ground level we are here. Steepleman aptly melds the film's personal and professional plots to tell the same story. On one hand, you have Ruth and Meredith's marriage, which is an even domestic partnership strengthened by mutual support and respect that shines in contrast to the hidebound discrimination that Bader Ginsburg suffers both in her education and in her job, and which she eventually fights in the courts. Felicity Jones plays Bader Ginsburg a little more fiery than fans of RBG have grown to know her as, but it's the more dramatic choice. Behind the camera, Letter tells the story well. One of my favorite things is how she uses Ginsburg walking as both a visual motif and as a metaphor for the movie's theme, that legal discrimination is an evil built step by step and is dismantled the same way. So who's the next justice to get a movie? I hope it's Brett Kavanaugh. Maybe Harvey Weinstein will produce it. I hear he's not doing anything right now. This has been Take Two Movie Review. I'm Clinton Johnston. Catch up with us at TakeTwoMovieReview.com and feed us back on our page on YouTube.